finally. I've been waiting here for you for a long time. Who am I? It doesn't matter. But I know you want to be a great businessman of all ages. Let me help you. First, you have to tell me your name. Lin Peng Chao. You know what? I can pronounce that. So we're gonna roll with it. Lin Peng Chao. Nice name. Then again, let me see where you are now. Oh, uh, where would we want to start out? Caravan props that can be found in this area are Cornucopia. Trade firm strategy effect plus 50%. Mpuan, Southwest Province, Caravan's maximum load capacity, can travel by water, Fatigue Accumulation minus 50%, 3 Contribution, Quest Complete, I don't know what any of this stuff means, Probability of Resisting the Negative Effects of Random Events, I mean that sounds kind of nice and helpful in some, yeah. That'd probably be good. Can travel to Tubo. Is that status cap on all carriers? Can travel to place. Um. What if I just like close my eyes and then click a bunch, and then we start here? Do you need to start a tutorial? Yeah. Most likely that'd be a good idea. Ling Ling, this is a good place, and everything will start here. In the business world, everyone's dream is to become the merchant. This is a much respected title among the business community and your ultimate goal. Although you have big dreams, at first we still need to keep our feet on the ground and start as a porter. I've got a series of tutorials for you which can be viewed in the list of tasks on the left, and I've included the methods for accomplishing each of them. Purchase your first cart. Click on the place where you are stationed, purchase and buy a cart as you like. Carts can provide load capacity, you will need load capacity to make purchases. Are we in a broken leaf? No, we're not. Are we here? This doesn't take a hundred days or so. For some reason it's like automatically scrolling up to the top left here. Alright, so apparently it's from the uh... Alright, after all of that stuff I'm not entirely sure where we are. Oh, I see. Ling Ling Village. We're here. Alright, so we have in the village. God, there's quite a bit of information in this. Cost 10 days, 10 fatigue for exploration. House in request market post station. Let's check. The how can I help you? We have no messages. Buy. Nothing to buy. Number of carts. Gotcha. A uh, donkey cart or horse cart has a higher speed. For an extra 500. It has a lower load. The ox is the highest carrying capacity with the slowest speed. We have 10. So yeah, we'll just spend half of it on the cart for now. You can sell, repair, upgrade, etc. after purchasing a cart. Right. However, please note that the load capacity of a fart will decrease when the carrier's condition falls below 50. A uh, bit of a typo there. If the developer wants to uh, run back on that one. If the moving speed of your caravan slows down suddenly, you might need to repair your carts. And the next step is to make a purchase. 
Alright, so then we'll go... Oh, I didn't. The wrong one. So we come into the market. We can't buy citrus. But we can get paper. Although it's... I'm assuming... It's not being sold at great prices here. We can right click to go back. Uh, that's gonna be... I'm gonna end up doing that on accident a lot. So it's gonna be like 2,000. I mean... Total weight of 40. of our load in paper that's very expensive maybe a little under because I mean we need to also sell it for more than 2.8% markup we need to sell for more than 444 that could be unpleasant to try to find we've made our first purchase hooray all commodities will be restocked every year in January. Every year in January, April, July, and October, the prices of the commodities will change. The next step is to find a place to sell the commodity with the highest profit through inquiry. Gotcha, so what's the house? Would you like to build a house here? It needs a lot of money. 20,000, we need 10 wood and stone. In the inn, we can have an, a, get an accommodation. Sleep here. No messages. Uh, we can recruit. Cost us 5,000. You will find 3 to 5 candidates. So we get attacked by bandits or something like that along the way. Oh, you can establish a firm. After creating your firm, you can compete for shares of the local commodities to gain income automatically. You can create a firm in every place, but they all belong to your firm. To create a firm in this village, you will need 80,000 copper and Yangtze River Province Contribution Zero. That's expensive. Um, Wuling. It's a metropolis. Yeah, let's go to the big city. That sounds cool. I don't know what those are all about. We gained three fatigue on our walk. Level of state. Hmm. Okay. Well, that's not horrible. But we don't want to sell the donkey. We don't want to sell the cart. <clears throat> oh, it's 1400 here. Well, that's... A solid profit. Lun gun. I have no idea what that is. Well, kind of like clementines, or something like that. Mandarin oranges. Spend two thousand. Getting a fair amount. Not firm. The quests you claimed in a higher ranked place will be harder to accomplish, but also with more rewards. You can complete four quests. Alright, so we probably don't want to take a 42 million coins. So we'd probably want to take like a, uh, a village quest or something.
Yeah, let's go to the Yisha. Yishan. Bit of a smaller town. They're buying them for 3,000 each. Or maybe that was total. Still made a bit of a profit. Not an amazing one, but it's profit. 663, let's see if we can sell those for more. Let's go to the village and try to get a quest here. Send a letter to the innkeeper. Crucian carp. Buy seven duck and send a pawn. And we'll try to find some ginger. We'll claim this quest. There's mushrooms and citrus here. Maybe they have ginger out here. Start your business. Oh, that was from the first day. Gotcha. Mmm, chrysanthemum, no ginger. 7,200 for the total price. Yeah, that's quite a bit better than... I gotcha. Part-time work. Oh. We spent 15 days here to get 700 copper. Uh, I probably should have read a little more before just clicking. We'd make much better money by just doing this stuff. Let's run some chrysanthemums off somewhere. We have a nice, good-sized city out here. Does not have... to recruit someone to be able to run another hostel recruitments is 75,000 copper Traveling to Motuo requires felt hats. Too cold out there. Now let's go here. You were staring at the stars late one night, reflecting on your past. Intelligence and experience, plus 20. Intelligence experience? Do we have, like, a... our own... skills of some form? Oh, that's kind of nice to see. City is it? Yeah, it's still seventy-five thousand. Not cheap. Forty-nine hundred total. Plus sixty-nine percent. It's 
what we would make 69% profit on it. Let's see if we could possibly go further. We'll fix up our donkey. Maybe upgrade it? Only seven point, that's half of our money. Could potentially make more. Uh, for an extra ten. Card has been successfully upgraded. Anything else? I don't believe so. Our total assets are 13.2. Well, there's the duck, but... Unfortunately, still not the thing that we're looking for. Need some ginger. Got some nice fresh sugar cane here. Thirty nine hundred for the chrysanthemums. All right, let's sell them. They're heavy. We could transport seven banana. They're kind of cheap at the moment. Yeah, let's fill up on them. And then maybe rest at the inn for four days at 200 coppers. Is this how much? Oh. Uh, did you have a good rest? I think, yes. I've been looking at the wrong icon for how much money I have. It's This is how much money I have. I'm foolish. Establish a firm here. Yeah, right, so we need 80,000 of these special coins. Wood and green bean cake. So I'm not entirely sure how much money I had and that I spent. But I feel like I would want to go to a bigger city that, to sell the bananas. Yeah, 5,800. It's already better. A boar that came out of nowhere attacked your caravan, and you and the caravan members fought. Together to beat it. <laughs> you and your caravan members fought together to beat it. Martial arts experience plus 22. Yeah, we put the smack down on that boar. So it's all just like straight. Story stuff. There is. Uh Okay, so the bar will kind of fill, and then we'll gain levels with that sort of stuff. We're the first generation patriarch. It kind of seems like we'll have family that will continue this whole business. The family. <laughs> Maintain the family business. 10,000. Bananas are expensive here. It's bananas. We have 10,000 coins now. Any ginger? No. Bummer. Uh, apricots? Probably. Get ourselves a nice profit on that. So, like, any village you could make a town? Or, uh... House in? No. 
Is it only like our home starting village? Potentially. Still no ginger. Croakers are cheap. The rice doesn't seem to be any which way. So we made a few thousand profit off that. We get more rice than it's four percent down. Let's do it. We'll go all in on the fishy. here. Take a long journey. Late one night, you read a classic book on business. We gain 39 business experience. Cool. And we made it safely. Hmm. We'll make another 4,000 profit on that. Hmm. Paper's pretty cheap. Imperial. That sounds pretty fancy. Do we have ginger here? No rice wine. Ooh. Have quite a party though. Maybe a slight profit. And then maybe a bunch of like sugar cane? With some wheat instead? Let's go with the wheat. I don't know what that's on, but... Uh, we're at 24 fatigue. We're a quarter of the way sleepy. What's this at? 81? Let's fix up the cart. Are we still only at one cart allowed. 320 copper from a metropolis place. 320,000, rather. It's really expensive. How much is it going to be here in the Imperial place? Level Imperial. Well, this is like... Where the, the King's Palace. Oh. Treasures. We have no points to pick a treasure. Please wait for next year to pay tribute. Okay. Sure. Well, let's go to the village. We got wheat and potatoes. Their wheat is even cheaper. Crude 5,000 copper. Uh, Alright, let's do it. So, no matter what, this is all just gonna cost the same. Um, I don't know how important awareness and stuff would be. This one seems like maybe the best all-rounder. Maybe go this way. I don't know where Charm is going to rank on everything. 
Um. Well, you know what? I like this guy's hat. We're gonna pick him, because he has a cool hat. And then we should be able to... Can't buy another cart. Did we not recruit someone? I'm not too sure. I feel like I spent money. Personnel. Detail. Even though you were busy with business, you found a little time for martial arts training to gain 27 martial arts experience. Status is free. Uh, no, I don't want to do anything like that. Who was recruited? No props possessed. Right, we yeah. don't. Dumb. Well, he's employed, so that's, you know, that's good. There seems to be someone selling mushrooms. Let's go and take a look. You see someone selling mushrooms in the market, but they don't look good. Will you buy them and share them with the caravan? If you make a choice, you can see the result next time. But they don't look good. They don't look... I you know, don't know. You think the mushrooms can be poisonous, so you walked away and nothing happened. We don't need to poison ourselves. That doesn't seem smart. Remotely. Why would we do that? Just taking random sketchy looking mushrooms from guys peddling them on the street. Sell off the wheat. And these mushrooms are at quite a discount. Let's buy them up. Still not too sure what that means. Where are we again? Right. Um, maybe we'll come down here to the Zengi. My, many cities are holding ore season. The purchase price of all raw materials is reduced 180 days. Alright. We can speed up time as well. and cotton. 32% markup. And a little village here. Let me try recruiting again. Alright, we spent the money. I think our overall monthly cost increased. Oh, that cost money. It costs extra money to hire someone. Um, how does this all work? Five days, 250 copper. Yeah, let's take a nice good rest. Did you have a good rest? It was a good rest. It was pretty solid. I feel very rejuvenated. Still quite confused. We'll repair the cart. Not sure. It still says we only have one cart. 
doesn't let me click it and do anything. But we have more people. Hmm. Let's try the exploration thing. You found the following in exploration. 435 coins? We're gonna say we found a bunch of coins. Let's come over to the big metropolis place and dump off these mushrooms. Try to find some ginger. Still no ginger. Oh yeah, we're gonna double our money off of it. Lovely. I guess we'll get a bunch of these lawn guns. And then go sell them at a place. Maybe we'll bring them way up here. Can we get out in the desert without... Oh, wait, is that allowed? Let's try to zip it up. Found some more time for martial arts training. Always gotta keep yourself toned, ready to go. Need balance. You have a heated discussion with a hawker somewhere about the underlying logic of commodity pricing. Business experience increased. Because we are the best. The demand for citrus is rising. 269%. Got 13,000 for the lawn guns up here. Stone is pretty cheap. I guess we'll load ourselves up with a bunch of rocks. Fine ginger. No, nope. I haven't been over here yet. War season has ended. Does that mean we're gonna make bank off these rocks now? 486%. We sure are. Peaches. Oh, let's buy up the peaches. How would I be allowed to have another cart? Hmm. Maybe Jinping? You ran into an old man who is a retired craftsman with many years of experience. With his help, the conditions of all carts improved by 35 points. Well, thanks, friend. You fixed him up to being right as rain, brand new. What a pal. County. Peaches are worth twice as much as I bought them for. Oh, no ginger. Bacon. Sounds delicious. Go down here to the Hwanju. But we are getting tired. Your horse was frightened by a boar and you fell off the horse hitting your head. We lost intelligence. Made ourselves dumb. 
We gotta stop here, we're tired. We have traveled a long way, so let's take a rest at a nearby bar. Someone's coming over to buy you a drink? A stranger offers you a drink. Will you accept? Your character, 10. Yeah, let's be friendly. They poisoned the wine and you fainted. After you awoke, you realized that your money were gone. We lost 3,000. Bummer. That's pretty rude. Well, let's spend 450 and sleep here. We had a very good rest. I appreciate. Thank you. It's 50 coppers per person that we have in our party. I'm not sure. They are with us, right? No, they're not. I see. We've hired them, but not actually assigned them. Well, that's great. Thank you for your appreciation. Thank you for being a part of this. So he works as a guard. Oh. Fitness 7, Business 7. We're gonna have a guard. A chef, an accountant, and a craftsman. Navigator. Maybe we should have like a. He's got an eight in cooking. Eleven machinery. Um. Maintains the carts so they don't get busted up so long. Easy so quickly. What do these do? Can increase the basic load of your caravan and provide buffer load while also protecting protection for caravan. Just protects from bandits. Maybe. Maybe. No problem, leave it to me. Still just one cart. Really? Alright then. Very well. We'll fix up the carts and uh... What do we got? Mushrooms we can get double the price for here? We were heading down here. Let's see if we can get yet more. We're staring late at night into the stars. Pondered hard on it. We feel a little bit smarter. Yeah, let's sell them. 36,000. Coin redos. We can almost afford buying a house. We needed wood and something else to drop off there. Uh, the rice is cheap. We'll go in on that. Fuju. Apricots and peonies. Wow. Double our money there. Replace some of the apricots. Yes, Ling Ling. Yeah, that is our home. Down to Guanju. And sell all those apricots for another nice chunk of change. Yeah, we're not finding much of the. Hmm. And we'll take these all the way up here. The rats woke you up several nights in a row, and you didn't get a good night's rest. We gained a lot of fatigue. Maybe we'll stop here. Along the way. And get a good rest.
and then continue our way up to sell our bananas. You ran into an old man who was a retired craftsman with many years of experience. With his help, the condition of all carts improved by 24 points. What a pal. We've already spent over a year in-game. We're 18. Time sure flies when you're on the road. Having fun. 315%. I guess take the stone and do kind of like we had done before. Maybe we'll take it all the way down here to the Fuju. The journey will be long and perilous. A flock of ducks blocked the road of your caravan and you were told you told the others to stop and made way for the little creatures. We gained charm experience. We saw some duckies, and it was so cool. Someone is calling us over there. Let's go take a look. Oh no, their goods fell off and they need a hand. Man's goods were about to fall off his cart. Do you want to help put them back on? Sure, we'll help the old man. You helped carry it, but unfortunately broke your back. I'm starting to feel like every single one of these events is just terrible. They all have all ended pretty poorly. Health reduced by 20 points. I mean, there's no upside to them at all. It's all just... Your day sucks now. Only make 27% profit. That's not ideal. You go up here. You were in a mountainous region and you had to climb down the cliff to save your goods. We gain fitness experience. Seventy-five percent. This is all pretty cool. I can see. I could spend a fair amount of time on this. This is pretty well done for a totally free game. We need like wood. Maybe it was stone we needed as well. I'm not seeing. Those are at a bit of a reduced price. Let's grab them. <clears throat> and there's the wood. We'll make a little bit of money off of it. I don't remember what we needed, so let's just scoop them all up. And then we'll go back to our home village of Ling Ling. You watched a martial arts tournament and gained some insight from watching it. And we have an exclamation point. And we leveled up our martial arts to 11. Next title of Hawker. Promotion needs total assets of 50,000. Oh, we can get married after. We can do that. We are now a Hawker. And we got a new outfit. Cool. Click to return. Congratulations, your title has been upgraded to Hawker. This is the stepping stone to the brilliant road of business, and you have proved that you have basic trading abilities. Our next one's going to need total assets of 150,000, a maximum single sale of 25,000. We're pretty close. Then we'll be a village merchant. Look at us moving up in the world. 
That was so cool. We need ten wood. That was a lot less money than I expected. I thought I thought it was eighty thousand, but I guess I was thinking of something different. And the oranges are cheap. Might as well. Late one night, we do some business stuff. Yeah, let's keep that money rolling. And we'll buy the croakers. And then I guess we'll go back up to the... You know they have stone here. And we're gonna stop in here and sleep. on the fish at all. Well, let's keep going. You came to a river and took a bath while no one was around, and you were refreshed. I feel as though... You pass through a very bumpy and rugged section of road, and the condition of your carts are all reduced by 10 points. We have traveled a long way. Someone's coming over to poison us. I'm not taking your drink. So yeah, it's very beat up. Oh, um, now we're able to, uh, get a new cart. That would be lovely. Maybe it's because our title increased. Three hundred and fifty nine thousand. That's a slight jump in very oddly specific. 326,986. Alright, well, we're gonna have to sell a lot more fish then. A very massive, insane amount. Are you kidding me? That is filthy. It's gotta be cheaper. Like one of these smaller places, right? 174% profit. Love it. Is it cheaper here? The same exact price. That feels a little... Eee. Our cart's got all beat up again. Let's stop into this town and fix them. It's just a, like, really... 22,000. It's a level 3 maximum. Okay, so the bigger cities allow for the carts that can be upgraded better. In general, more. 22,000. Maximum load of 80. Alright. Purchase the new cart. It would be helpful to be able to buy sell more. Get some apricots. And I'm getting a loose understanding of what's going on here. You communicated with local businessmen about their experiences of getting rich. We gain more business experience. Dad is going to be so proud. We'll put in some more stones. So we just need four more stone and four more wood. We're pretty close. We're down to 27,000 copper dues. Ginger! There's ginger. But we need contribution. 
I don't know how we would get contribution. Send a letter to the innkeeper. Apples. I don't remember seeing apples. Send a letter to innkeeper in Luling. Do I just have to... Yeah. Request completed. Send a letter to the innkeeper in Luling. We got a contribution point for Luling. Alright, so we gotta do stuff like that. Hooray! The oranges are cheap. And the apricots are expensive. We need wood, primarily, and stone. Paper. It's not at all what I want. Nice orange croaker. Place your fitness improved when carrying goods. We're getting swole. Where was wood? Duck. Azaleas. Oh, that works out to a good price. That was where the wood was. We need four more. Need a slight profit off of it. So we get four wood and we'll fill the rest in beaches. We'll go over to the Jingju and we'll get a rest. We'll fix up the carts. And tea table. That looks like a chicken. 41% profit. We yeah, also sell the peaches and the azaleas. It's not a great price on them, is it? Thousand. Wonder if we could make a better profit off the duck. Up here, trading them for some stone. And then potentially, you pass a big tree and let everyone rest in the cool shade for a while. We lost some of our fatigue. Having a lovely nap. Many cities are holding ore. Ooh. Oh, the stone's gonna be cheap. There's a sneaky person ahead who seems to be trying to steal the neighbor's dog. You see someone stealing a dog. Step forward to stop. You saved the puppy, but the puppy got nervous and bite you. Fatigue plus 20. Dude, every single... Yeah, just say no to all of them. They're all bad. None of it's good. That's all I can take from this now. Plus 35%. Alright. Sure. That's actually a really good profit on the wood, too. Very well. And we'll buy all the stone out. 
We only need four of it to deliver to our town. Of Ling Ling. Now let's go all the way down here to deliver most of the other stone. You accidentally fell into the water and Sam swam desperately to avoid being bitten by crocodiles. We gain fitness experience. That's where they had the long guns. 488%. But isn't it like reduced because of the ore season? Or is it more valuable to them because of ore season? Get out of this one where it doesn't say we're season. We lost some fatigue. Lovely. Yeah, still 488%. Alright, let's uh sell them all here then. 12,000. Most good. I think we could actually build a house here too. No. We can establish a firm. I guess that's what the blue is all about. Alright. What do we have in here? Orchids. Kind of on the cheap. Scoop them up. Do we sell wood? Negative. We can double our money on our orchids. Replace them with some apricots. Yeah. Then we should uh, fix up the carts. 3k. It's getting expensive to keep them running, too. All requires balance. There is a festival going on, and the villagers enthusiastically invite you to join them for a day and a night of fun. We gain some fatigue from partying, partying hard all night long. We can double our apricot finances. Rice, let's do it. And let's get some rest here. After all that partying. It was quite the wild time. War season is over. And the market returns to normal. That's not much for profit. I think it's this one that had the wood. Izu, Ezu. Yes. Don't have storage space. Thank god they really need the rice. Um, so we're gonna buy the wood we need for the house. And then the rest on peaches. Peaches. We'll probably sell the peaches here. Drop the wood off in Ling Ling. You worked out in your spare time to gain some fitness experience. We get 11s now. Look at us. You spot a thief stealing. Don't shout. Don't nope, fuck it. Are these scripted to just be all every choice you make is just a fuck you? The thief stole the money and disappeared. Later you realize that he was picking your pocket. We lost 3000 coins. All right. That's fine. 200%. That's quite a chunk of change. Lovely. I guess the Longins. Quest claim. We got here. Send a letter to the innkeeper. Yeah, let's do that. I mean, it just seems to be like 
Meishan, so we just have to travel to that place, speak to the innkeeper, and we just get stuff and everyone's happy. Though there's not many identifying marks for which one. Alright, Ling Ling, our house. Put the wood in. We have the 20,000 coins available. Now let's make our house. New house completed. Oh, looks like crap. It's level 1 of 24. Maximum family size 1 of 4. It's a bedroom resilience of 6. When a quest is completed at the residence location, contribution in that location will increase by 1. And expand it, we need a lot more wood and stone. Maximum family sizes go up in bedroom resilience. Huh. Cool. Bedroom. <laughs> we have no spells to woohoo with to uh, attempt to create children. Eliminate all fatigue, reduced by 6 points per day. So we can rest here for free. That's good. And then any quests we do from here will be better for us. Buy 9 peonies and send to Ling Ling. Buy 6 stone and send to Ling Ling. We should be able to do these pretty easily. Daner. Stone. Yeah. You can have five ongoing quests. Gotcha. It's a Daner. Yeah. Alright, so we'll walk down here. Requires a wooden boat. Can we take a boat from there? Is that something it allows us to do? Played with a cat and it made us less tired. That's cool. E, I don't think it could it may not be. Let's explore? We found a duck. Cool. Odd. We get a good profit off the long gun. A crazy boar appeared out of nowhere. It's heading towards us. Crazy boar appears out of nowhere. Do you want to have a try? Subdue or run away? Our fitness is 11. Let's, I guess, was f ran away after you knocked off. The boar was fast and fierce and ran away after you knocked off. Health reduced by 35 points. Alright. Yeah, good. Is that bad? What happened? How much does this cost? 7.3k. 17k. 31k. Holy crap. It gets expensive. Yeah, we'll spend the 17 on it. It's been upgraded successfully. Lovely. Really like to hear that. Duck is kind of cheap. Let's fill our carts, plural, with them. How would... Alright, we got duck, treasures, props... I don't, I don't know what that means. I don't know what all that is all about. Inquiry. You can check out the selling prices of this commodity in other places. You can see how much we'll earn or lose the percentage after the... Yeah, okay. So ideally, then, we would want to go to, like... Inaccessible. Long City.
Alright. What, what did I say? Huangzhu. Is that it though? cute dog passed by and you play with it for a while. And you feel invigorated and inspired. You played Wakey with someone and after a day and a night of fierce playing you finally beat him or her in intelligence experience plus 22. We're so smart. Big brain. Sell wooden mushrooms. You get 26,000 for all of this duck. That's it. That's how you trade. Trading is the most basic way for us to gain profit. As you may have noticed during the trading process, some commodities require a certain amount of contribution to purchase. One of the major ways of getting contribution is to complete quests. Which I finally pieced together and actually started doing. In a debate with others, you convince them with elegant logic. We gain charm. Peanuts. Uh, yeah, we need like a... Peonies. Four percent of the mushrooms. We're doing it. We'll come here to Young Zhang. Rice is cheap, so we'll scoop that up. Peanut ginger. Peonies are in Bao Yang. Lu, Lu Yang? You ran into an old man who fixes up your carts because he's just so nice and friendly. That saves us a good chunk of change. How fortuitous. So we can sell all the rice for a tidy little profit. And we'll buy some peonies to bring back home to help complete that quest. And then we can probably sell like one. Or is it Wuling or Ling Lang? I don't It was Ling Lang. Because we were helping hometown. You accidentally fell into the water and swam away from crocodiles, increasing your fitness score. Someone's calling. His goods fell off and he needs a hand. Contributions gained. At the cost of breaking our spine. Alright. We broke our back, reducing our reducing our health by 20. We're 21! Three years went by? Oh my god. Yeah, this has ended up being a lot more fun than I expected it was gonna be. I got way more into this than I thought I was going to. This is pretty cool. There's definitely something here. So yeah, this has been a East Trade Tycoon. Is that? Yeah, East Trade Tycoon Inheritance. 
It is totally free on Steam if you have any interest yourself in checking it out. It's totally free. It, hell of a price. Can't beat it. Anyway, thank you very much for joining me today while we check this out. I hope that I see you guys in the next thing or whatever I do. Take care, everyone.